Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to The Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. Last time we got into Telfir, we talked to uh, Devathfir, I think was his name, and we are kind of half cured of Corpus disease. We got rid of our symptoms, but it's, we still have it. So that's pretty interesting, but we fast travel back to Ebonheart because that's the closest place to Balmora that we could find, and now we are on the road again. Going to get back on the road again. We're going to head up to Balmora. And I could probably, I mean, Vivek is right here. I could probably find a Silt Strider or something. Um, but we haven't been on this little peninsula over here. So I figure uh, let's take a walk. Let's go ahead and take a journey. Journeys are fun. We get to just kind of explore and see the world. And I do like that. I wish I could see more than 10 feet. But still, it's cool to kind of explore. So we're going to go ahead and... Take the long road and just and just take the scenic route, you know? You know we'll just take the scenic route. There will be plenty of signs and whatnot to get us where we need to go. So, uh, yeah. Ooh, boy. I should really record these things sooner. <laughs> um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Balmora this way. Gotcha. Let's go this way then, shall we? Do, 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 do. I like this, like, I like this part of Vardenfell. It's, like, green, grassy, and nice. Ebonheart's a really nice little place. Of all the towns I've seen so far in Morrowind, I would either live in Balmora or in Ebonheart. Those would be the two places I would want to live. Because they look so nice. Uh, where are we? Oh my god, wow. Okay, the map is not... See, this is... I don't understand exactly how this map decides where it's going to fill in. But I definitely went up this peninsula. I had to. I didn't... I mean, obviously. I guess I skirted this edge of it just enough that I was, like... It was getting this part of the map, this chunk, instead of this chunk. But, like, I already knew that most of that was water, so... You know, not incredibly helpful. Anyways... Um, I assume we need to go to the left here. Uh, oh, no, 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 this way. Um, have we seen this house yet, though? Oh, yeah, I think we did. I think we did, yeah. Um, I think this... Oh, well, no, we fast-traveled to, uh, Vivek, didn't we, the first time? Ah, I can't remember, it was a while ago. Getting back into the, uh darker kind of areas here with the giant mushrooms and the uh, foyadas, foyadas, something. Oh, this is the road we took to Pelagiad. I remember because I was like looking, there was a, a guar over there, but it wasn't a wild guar, so it didn't attack me. And I, yeah, I remember that being my first experience with a non-aggressive guar. Oh, a dreamer. Hello. Uh, here, oh, here's Pelagiad right here. Cool. Is that a cliff racer? Thought I heard a cliff racer, but I don't see one, so I think we're good. What am I hearing? What is that? Oh, it might be a scrib nearby as well. That's possible. Doo -doo -doo. I'm pretty sure... I mean, I know we're right next to Pelagia, but I'm pretty sure we have been down these roads. Oh, there's where I saw the guar. Yeah. Um. And there's Pelagia right there, where I got one of my nice hammers. I don't know if I found my... Shock mauler or my flame mauler in there, but I found it in a freaking crate next to some random person's building. And I was like, hey, that's cool. <laughs> so, you know. I mean now I got this. And I don't even I don't even need anything else. I'm good with this. But uh now speaking of equipment and stuff, I just noticed my robe is not uh equipped. Let's go ahead and put that on there. Not that I need healing right now, but I like to have it ready. Just have it ready when I need it. Speaking of ready, oh, my charge on this hammer is not very good. Hmm. Hmm. Well, at least at this point, I pretty much I pretty much know the road back to Balmora. Uh, without having to follow the signs or anything too much here, you can just run straight back and probably be fine. Probably. We, I think we did go in there a while ago. <clears throat> Apologies again for the throat clearing and the sniffling. My allergies are still going crazy. It's been an incredibly hot summer, um, at least for you know where I live. It's not typically this hot, and my allergies are not happy. Not one bit. 
Now that I know this section of the map here, this southwest corner of the map a little bit better, I'm tempted to, if I have time, I'm going to rewatch episode one and two of my of my own Let's Play and just see where the hell I went, because I got seriously lost. And now I'm going through here barely looking at the road signs like, yep, I know where I'm going. I got seriously freaking lost in the first couple episodes. And I remember she was one of the first NPCs that I met um, outside of a town. And I don't know. I don't know how I got so horribly lost. But I ended up really far away from Balmora because I took a wrong turn somewhere. So, like at this point, I'm pretty sure we need to cross through the Foyata for a second. And, oh, hello. Hello, Kagooty. Hiya. Hiya. Wow, that thing is bigger than I thought it was. Never really saw myself next to it in third person. We basically have to go in here, turn right, go short distance straight, and then turn left, and then we're out, and then we're real close to Balmora. Come here. I know you want to. I hate you. 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 There. <laughs> it's like when you're sitting around a campfire and the smoke starts blowing in your face. You say, I hate rabbits, I hate rabbits, I hate rabbits. And then somehow the, the smoke magically uh, blows somewhere else. The wind just kind of changes. Don't know why. Don't know why it works. And you don't even have to mean it. You can just say that randomly and then not mean it. It just still works. Can't explain it. Cannot explain it. Did that in Boy Scouts all the time. So this is what? Moon Moth? I always forget. What are you? Moon Moth? Moon Moth. Yeah. There's a lot of them end in the word moth. There's Fort Moon Moth, Fort Buck Moth, Fort Frost Moth. I think Frostmoth is actually the one on Solstheim. And the only reason I know that is because of Skyrim. There are an awful lot of these dreamers around here. Freaking... What are they doing here? Make America great again! No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. I'm not gonna... <laughs> I'm not gonna dive into that in this... <laughs> Let's play. Uh, no, that would be a Shiza storm. That would... No. Nope. Just, just for lols, people. Have a sense of humor. <clears throat> and good old foggy, dark, dingy, sort of, kind of, Balmora. This is the only thing I don't like about this. If it were brighter and sunnier and greener, I would like Balmora a whole lot more. But I do like the canalway kind of setup. What am I doing? I need to go to Caius. I'm going the wrong way. I know this city really well at this point. Yeah, I'm still going wrong way. Oh, man. And... Where is it? Oh, that there's staircase over there. Caius, my friend, I have news for you. I am, uh... Well, I still have Corpus, but, uh... All my symptoms are gone. And all the benefits are still there. Hi. Can you put on a shirt, please? I've been talking to you for how long now? Jeez. Um, uh, thank you for your report. I'm very happy you've been cured. Unfortunately, I've had a bit of bad news. I've been recalled to the Imperial City. You'll be promoted to operative. And we'll head the blades here in Vardenfell until I return. Wait, what? I've only waited here to give you your final orders before I go. <clears throat> uh, recalled, eh? Internal politics. Some concern about my sugar. I thought about refusing to recall, but they have members of my family back in the capital. I'm afraid it may have something to do with the problems with the succession. As the Emperor's health declines, factions are maneuvering for advantage. I may be gone a while. That's why you are promoted to operative. That makes you the ranking Blades agent here in Vardenfell District, as far as I know. There may be other Blades agents here I don't know about. It wouldn't surprise me. I may be gone a while, and you'll have expenses. Here's some gold. And you could use the house until I return. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. And I won't be needing these these blacks or the ring while I'm in Cyrodiil. Blacks? What? Maybe they'll come in handy. Oh, black pants. Black shirt. And his ring. And 750 gold. Cool. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, head, head the blades. 
There's nothing to it. Each agent has his own assignment and reports directly to Cyrodiil. Your promoted operative mostly preserve your independence. You are no fool. The days of the Empire are almost over. When the Empire di uh, Emperor dies, nine hells are going to break loose. Forget about what. Forget about the Imperial City. Think locally. Worry about the Sixth House and Dagoth Ur, and squabbles between the Great Houses and the Colonists. The rest of the political nonsense doesn't amount to a plate of scuttle. Well, okay. Uh, what was the last thing? Oh, orders. Yeah. Continue pursuing the Nerevarian prophecies as the Emperor command as the Emperor commands. First, go to the Hall of Wisdom and Justice and get Maramilo to help you find the lost prophecies. She's being watched. If something has gone wrong, find her private quarters. She'll leave you a message there under the code word Amaya. Then take the lost prophecies to Nibani Mesa. From that point you'll have to follow her directions and follow the prophecies. Good luck. Okay. Uh, lost Prophecies... Mara Milo says the dissident priests do have records of Ashland and Erevering Prophecies, and she has an idea how we might get a look at them. Mara Milo, can I ask you about her? Oh boy. Uh, topics? Uh, da -da 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 -da. uh, Mara Milo. <clears throat> Temple Priestess who works in the library is at the Hall of Wisdom and Justice. She's a friend, so be careful and don't get her in trouble. The temple is suspicious of outlanders and what they're talking with you about. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Isn't she the uh, librarian at the Library of Vivac? That's here. Uh, it's the lower level. It's just. It's a bit of a maze in there. Just keep looking. Okay. So that. Oh, yeah. So she's back in Vivac. And the other person is um, Nabani Mesa. Yeah, Nabani Mesa. Isn't she back in that town that we were in that we went to? Uh, the Urshilaku camp or something? Nabani Mesa. Can I ask you about Nabani Mesa? Please? No. Dang it. I think that's where she was. He, she, they, it, I don't know. Um, well, we did just make a nice long journey, so I suppose we can fast travel back to... Whoop, up, yep, up, cool, cool, good for you, sleeper. Um, how about you go to sleep and leave me alone so I can get on with my business. Uh, let's take the Silt Strider back to Vivek. We did, you know, we did just make a nice long journey, so... Uh, yeah, not quite a full-blown, like, adventure into the Vardenfell episode, but, uh, still, a, a decent little journey. Will you please get back up on this platform where you belong? Jeez, Selville. You're crazy, you know that? Uh, uh, Vivek, please, and thank you. No, I'm I'm all right, really. Uh, Vivek is right there. Ta-da! Where am I going? Topics. Um, Maramilo. Uh, Library of Vivek. Uh, Vivek Vivek Temple Canton, Hall of Wisdom. Temple is like the south here, isn't it? Yeah, south uh, southeastish. So, that way. We'll find it. We'll find it eventually. There's the foreign car. Oh, it's beginning to rain. We just actually had a big thunderstorm roll through in, in real life as well. Oh, look, lightning. Man, it's, uh, I'm recording this the night of July 5th, and I'm, as I'm driving home on the highway, I can see, like, heat lightning in the clouds and stuff. Um, and I'm still seeing fireworks going off. I'm like, guys, like, I know there's not a direct line from the firework to your hand or anything for you to get zapped, but, but really, do you want to send something with that much, like, energy into the sky, right? Do you really want to do that? I mean, <laughs> it's not a great idea. Again, I know there's nothing for it to, like, follow them back to the ground or whatever. To, or follow it back to them on the ground. But do, do you really want to do that? I mean, do, is that really a good idea? You kind of just, you know, sending a whole lot of really charged particles up into the air in the form of an explosion. Now, I'm no physics expert. 
But the general idea behind lightning is it has something to do with charged particles. And I'm gonna assume that when things are exploding, there's some energy being released there. Uh, so, actually, that part I know. So, yeah. Maybe don't send a firework up into a lightning-filled sky that's already full of charged particles just waiting for something to come along and, you know, set them off or put them back together. <clears throat> yeah. Anyways. Um, we are trying to find the library in here somewhere. Ooh, let's see, uh, sign maybe, Lib oh, Library of Vivec, here we go, perfect. Do 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 do, where are you, where is she? I thought she was like back here last night, excuse me, ordinator. Uh, uh, um, uh, where'd she go? Where, where is she? Where? Uh, you're not. No. And you are not. No. What is this? Hall of Wisdom. Hall of Wisdom. Let's go to the Hall of Wisdom, shall we? Let's see what's in here. Hi. Oh, wait. We're back down here. Um. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Go to the Hall of Wisdom and Justice, where Mara Milo will tell me how to get the Lost Prophecies. Hall of Wisdom, Hall of Wisdom and Justice? Is that, am I, is this, are you, what's happening here? Oh, hello. Uh, Hall of Justice. Okay. Um, well this doesn't look like a maze or anything. Oh, hi, you're actually like named and stuff. Oh, oh, what? Office of the Watch. Okay. Ordinator Barracks. Ordinator Barracks. This can't be right. Or is it? Um, well, let's see. Temple that just goes outside, I guess. Ordinator Barracks. And let me guess. The Barracks. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hall Underworks. No. No, I don't think that's where we need to go. Um, justice offices. Maybe. Hello. What? Uh. Wooden door. Oh, jeez, this room is a little bit. This building, I mean, is a little bit bigger, bigger than I thought it was. Oh boy, I am never gonna find who I'm looking for in here, am I? Wooden door. Hello. Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh, be quiet. Before I'm tempted to kill you all where you stand. Hmm. Hmm. We were heading north. That St. Dellen? I guess that just goes outside again. <sighs> uh head back over here hmm Hall of Justice we need the hmm library of Vivek oh hello can I get by you let's see can oh what that cannon quarters cannon offices oh uh is she in there what time is it right now it's 1 a.m. Let's give her seven hours. And we'll see if that's unlocked. No. Oh, ordinator's gone. Well, uh, here's the thing, right? You see... You see... I have a thing of, of opening, don't I? A ring. Chameleon, fortify sneak, fortify luck, fortify security. Uh, is it? Oh, I already have it equipped. Open 20 points on touch. Uh, yeah, so that should work for me. Do, 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 do. Amulet of opening. Let's save the game real quick here, just in case. And. Ah! What? 
No one's here. Oh, note to Amaya. Amaya, sorry I missed you. I had to run some old documents over to the Inquisitor at the Ministry of Truth, and I'm likely to be tied up there for a while. Why don't you meet me there as soon as you can? Then we can leave together as soon as I'm done. And Amaya, don't forget to bring me the two divine intervention scrolls you borrowed, or if you use them, buy a couple of new ones for me. I think I'm going to need them soon. Uh, Janan de Malin Malini at the Mages Guild in the Foreign Quarter keeps them in stock. Uh... Alvela Saram is the guard at the entrance. Just tell her you're looking for me and she'll let you in. Uh, you'll f your faithful friend, Mara. P.S. I left a couple of levitate potions here for you just in case. I couldn't remember if you knew the spell or not, so I drew a couple from stock. Oh. Cool. Um, Alright, I think that's what we were looking for here. Uh, nah, I won't raid her stuff. Eh, she hasn't done anything to me. She's a good friend, so... I won't, uh, I won't just take, un you know, unnecessary stuff. Um, alright, I should probably take the note to Amaya so that I can, like, remember what's going on here. Um, <clears throat> here's the thing, right? Define, define a couple. Um, the two divine intervention scrolls. I might have two, still. Let's see. Uh, I know I used one. I thought I was given a couple. I guess not. I guess I only had the one. All right. Well, where? Uh, we gotta go somewhere to buy new ones. Um. Hmm. Mages Guild, the Foreign Quarter. Gotcha. All right. Da da da. Hey, as long as no ordinators stop us at any point and. Try to, like, inspect our possessions or whatever the hell. Uh, we'll be fine. We'll all be fine. Da -da 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 -da. Excuse me, sir. I just need to get by you. Thank you. And... Wait for it. We're out. Da -da -da. See you later, suckers. I'm off to fulfill the Nerevarine prophecies. Ha ha! I should not announce that to the city. I should not. I should be quiet. I should be quiet about this. Sneaky, sneaky. We're a, we're a full-blown operator blade now. You'd be sneaky. It's very, very sneaky. No one must know what we are up to. We must have secrecy amongst our plans. Our great plans of what we are going to do here. The ordinators keep a close watch. And they ain't like problems or interference. They just want to hide the Nerevarine prophecies, but no, no, we shall fix that. Yes, we shall. I am the Nerevarine, I think, and I will fulfill those prophecies. Interesting thing about prophecies is they, they never... Here's, here's the thing. Whenever someone finds some crazy prophecy somewhere, they try to fulfill it. If it's if it's a true prophecy, it'll fulfill itself. But what ends up happening is people try to fulfill a prophecy like manually or quickly or on their own, and um, she or I mean they they uh, what was I doing? Let's see, the Ma uh, mages killed foreign quarter, mages killed foreign quarter. Um, they they end up wreaking havoc and doing all kinds of other crazy destructive stuff in the process. Perfect example, right, um, in terms of video games anyways. I'm sure there are real life examples. I just don't know any off the top of my head, but in in, in a video game example, look at uh, the Dawnguard DLC in Skyrim. Everything evil that Harkon does is because of him trying to fulfill some stupid prophecy. So, uh, you know world might have been a much better, safer place if he just wasn't trying to do that. Fulfill a damn prophecy, but I'm sure there are real-life examples of that. I, you know, I don't know any off the top of my head again, but uh, I would not be even a little bit surprised. Where is this door that I'm seeing? It must be, like, underneath me or something. 
The Mage's Guild in the Foreign Quarter, you say? Huh? Um... Well, do you know anything about the Mage's Guild? I guess not. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Uh, where would I find that exactly? Um, stats. Nope, map. Here we go. Uh, local map. Upper Waste Works. Apothecary. Canal Works. Alchemist. Rare books. Upper Enchanter. Foreign. Um. Corner Club. Foreign Quarter. Hmm. 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 Uh, let me see here. Um. <laughs> Why don't you meet me there? Uh. Bra two divine intervention scrolls. Uh. Malini at the Mage's Guild in the Foreign Quarter. Mage's Guild Foreign Quarter. I'm here in the Foreign Quarter. And her name was what? Janan de Malini. Well, maybe she's the enchanter. So let's I'm see if I can you. find that room again. I found it like immediately on accident. Enchanter, here we go. Do to do to do. Hi, is it just you in here? Okay, you're not the person then. Mal Malini is the name. Um map again let's see uh ordinators and stuff let's go to the upper <sighs> waste works and look around again hmm 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 Nope, nope, uh, nope, um, mm, nope, nope, foreign quarter. It's just like, where am I gonna end up being right now? Oh, all the way, all the way up here, I guess. Alright, um, hmm, oh, athletics leveled up, isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? Uh, where the hell am I supposed to be going right now? Anytime <sighs> now. Hmm. You know, I I am looking for someone in particular, actually. Uh, let's see. Mage's kill. Okay, here we go. You'll find the Imperial Guilds, Fighters Guild, Mages Guild, and an Imperial Cult Shrine down in the Canal Works. Okay, Canal Works, should we head down there, I guess? We can try to find something down there and hope for the best here. <clears throat> Lower Waste Works. I'm sure plenty of people watching this that have played this a lot are just banging their head against the wall like, You idiot! Go over there! You moron! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is my first time playing this game, remember? Oh, okay, this is part of the issue. I kept thinking Canal Works was the Underworks, which is like the sewer. Not quite the same thing, obviously. I didn't know that until just now. I just realized it, of course, because I'm a dumb. I'm a dumb. Um, bookseller. Uh, I mean, we can see if she's in here. Hi there. No, not you. No. Where? I'm looking for the Mage's Guild here, sir. There's, like, nothing else down here. Um. Which confuses me a little bit. Whoa, TV. Oh, God. Thought the game crashed or something. Ja, Raisha. That's the... That's not where we want to be. Let's see. These all go to the Underworks. Is there more than one canal works I should know about here? Because, okay, let's see. It looks like... Yeah, alright, I'll try to remember... Try to remember that. Um, 
lower waste works. Okay, so there's one canal works right on on that side. Uh, if I cross over to the west side, is there another canal works? This is, this is this appears to be a different canal works. Yeah, I think it is. Um, okay. Clothier, clother. Uh, Jan, Jan, right? Jan. Let's see. Um, magic? No, inventory. I need to read that letter. Janand. Jian. Close. Um, similar name. Not quite what I'm actually looking for here. Uh, quarter tomb. Hmm. Hmm. Wooden door. Uh,. Hi. Oh, Imperial Cult Altar. You know what? I might as well go ahead and do this since I'm standing here. Uh, yeah. Let's just restore attributes. Please and thank you. Thank you very much. I think my willpower was lowered for some reason. Yeah, it was. So, it fixes that. Not uh, It's a huge deal, but, you know. Quarter Tomb. Where the hell is the Mages Guild down here? Uh, traitor. Uh, guy, clother. Hey, ordinator. I know you don't like to talk much, but can I ask you? Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Hey, do you know about the the mages guild? Nope. Uh, let's ask him for a guild guide. <sighs> Please. You know what? I'm not gonna try and persuade you if you're not even gonna bother. Because you're a jerk. Um You won't just tell me about the major skill, or rather I can't just directly ask about it. Let's see. <clears throat> you can only travel uh by as fast as way uh, da, 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 da. Mage's Guild in the Foreign Quarter. Yeah, where is the Mage's Guild here in the Foreign Quarter? Holy crap, is it in the Underworks? I'm beginning to think so. Jeez, let's check the Quarter Tomb, I guess. I don't expect to find what I actually need down here. But, I mean, what else am I going to check right now at this point? Oh, what the, what the, oh, hi. I didn't expect there to be anything in here that was aggressive. Interesting, oh, hello. Okay, a lot of stuff in here that wants to kill me. All right, what the hell? Uh... Huh. Very interesting. What are you, are you a bone walker? Really? Why are you why are you in here? What are you? What are you? Greater bone walker. Ah. Soul gem. Cool. Um there's a chest here. Lock level 60. Crate, crate. Uh the hell. What is this place? Well, I don't think this will work, but... Well... Hmm. I was afraid of that. Well, 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 well. Oh, shoot, we're over time. Oh my god, I didn't even look. I was actually having fun. <laughs> ah! He's got me pinned. Die already. Die. There we go. Soul gem. Alright. Last thing before we quit this episode here. Uh, da, 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 Alright, so we've saved. Now what I want to do is go to my magic menu and go to a scroll of what's his name's and Hinge and we're going to use that on this chest and we're going to see. Oh, it didn't work. Um, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Uh, let's try that again. See, I think, yeah, 40 to 60. So I kind of have to get really lucky for it to come up as exactly 60. And I'm out of those. And that's why we saved. So we're going to load that. There we go. That never happened. Um, man, I wish I had, like, a really awesome enchanted thing to unlock high-level stuff. An enchanted thing or a really good spell or something. 
Anyways, that will have to do it for this episode of Morrowind. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. And as always, I hope to see you all in the next video.